afraid of these colorful snakes. They are easy to make and use just a few simple supplies. For this project you will need a red pipe cleaner, six colorful pipe cleaners, fingernail clippers, pencil or pen, thick white craft glue, and googly eyes. We're going to start with the head of the snake. Take one pipe cleaner, hold it up against a pencil so that you're just holding on to the very end, and you're going to loop the pipe cleaner around the pencil with the coils right on top of each other. So you're making a little bundle. Take your second pipe cleaner and do the same thing right over the top of that last bundle. We just want the head to be a little bigger. Tuck in the end and then you can slide that off the pencil and set it aside. Now we're going to make the four body parts of the snake. So you're going to hold that pipe cleaner up against the pencil just like you did for the head. But this time instead of putting the coils one on top of the other, we're going to make them go right next to each other. So it's like you're creating a spring. Okay, when you're done with that, you can slide it off the pencil set it aside, and make three more. For one of the coils, which we're going to make the tail of the snake, you're going to twist it a little tighter than the rest of them. At the very end, make a little point at the end of the tail and then make a few of those coils just a little tighter. Put the snake together by starting with the red pipe cleaner and the very end here is going to become the tongue. So you can make a forked tongue, um, you can leave it straight or you can do a small coil. So thread on the bundle that's going to be the head first. Don't push it all the way to the end. You want to have a little bit of that tongue showing. Then thread on the three body sections. And as the body sections come together, you can twist those two end coils together just so that they stay attached. You'll notice that the red pipe cleaner is too long for my last piece, so I'm going to take the fingernail clippers and I'm going to clip off just enough to make sure that last piece can stay on there securely. I like to use fingernail clippers instead of scissors uh, because cutting pipe cleaners with your scissors can make them dull. You can certainly use wire cutters, but I just have a dedicated pair of fingernail clippers for my pipe cleaner projects. Okay, so you're going to get all those pieces on there securely. Well, you can bend your snake however you would like. The very last step is to glue on some googly eyes. Use a thick white craft glue to put on the eyes. Don't worry if you use too much, it'll dry clear. You just want to use enough to get those eyes to stick on there really well. You can make these snakes in a variety of colors and sizes. If you want to make a longer snake, you could twist two of the red pipe cleaners together so that you can add more body parts. And you could also um, use different colors, alternating colors on the body parts so it'll be a little bit more interesting. But have fun. Mm -hmm.